three vegans take on $138 worth of pizza. Yeah, well, it's not, it's not gonna be in one go. I'm gonna do it in one. No, no, no. Thank you. Number two. First one was an alu. Ala. Ala. Turak. Turco. Turco. And this is a bazalia with cheese. Mm. I don't like cheese. You don't like it. Cheese. <laughs> yeah, it's alright. At number three, we have the lentil dal. It's very lentily. It kind of tastes like a curry lentil pie. Oh, this one's spicy. Hello. Oh, son. Not a full. No mouthful still. The vegan mm. with cheese. Can you have beans? Hmm? So this would make some beans. Beans. The lucky beans. No, the vegan. Mm. 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 And then he's like, when you're in the toilet, he's like, oh, I haven't got the lucky beans. But I can put something else on you for you. Ah. So the vegan with modifications. Mm -hmm. The vegan. Mm. No, my favourite's the bazalia, but I would have it without cheese. The bazalia. And then the aloe turco, and then the vegan, and then the lentil dal. That's oh. how I'm rating it. Oh. Yep. Basically, it's my ideal of pizza because it's just veggies on bread. Simple, no cheese, no like unnecessary crap. <laughs> pizza is unnecessary on Healthy. Cheese is unnecessary on pizza. Mm, yeah. So, what are your thoughts? Is cheese. Necessary or unnecessary on pizza? We're talking about vegan cheese here. None of that cow plus cruelty crap. Hang on, wait, it does it. It tastes good as well. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to those vegan bitches and I'll see you back here in one week time for our next video together. In the meantime, don't forget, go vegan, stay vegan. Peace out.